Uh, did did everyone see the Taylor Swift and Celine taps? Oh, yeah. mm -hmm. Did <laughs> that was pretty cool. Oh, they look great. I I got especially excited with Taylor Swift's um, just because I'm. I, there's something about protecting advocates of truth who are speaking out, and it was like, I mean, it's. I know I saw a lot of people sharing it, and I know I shared it a bunch, and yeah, it was great. And and Celine Dion's was the taps where you could feel the healing happening. So, so what you guys should do, give us a list of others that you want to want us to do. People that are you know putting themselves out there and getting beaten up for the the privilege. They're um, hard on us, though. I mean, because Marvin, Marvin was exhausted too. Usually, it's just me, but Marvin, Marvin said he's so tired, he's too tired to sleep. And I go, bingo! That's how it feels. It's like you're so exhausted, even sleeping is effort. So, so yeah. I mean, if there's others that you want us to do, or just suggest, um, let us know. We should actually put it out there. Get people to comment um, and let us know. And we should definitely put these on that the protecting the advocates of truth um, page on Facebook and LinkedIn. So we should just definitely do that. I, I feel like it's working already. You know, with because there's so much more positive press on who they are now, and the two of them, their their love for each other, and. I just feel like that's being highlighted more than it would have been. So I see it working. Well, you think of like someone at that level of consciousness, maybe, maybe she wouldn't, she, we, she would have been fine if we didn't do the work, but there's all the residuals, like the fans and the, the relationship. And I actually see them getting married really quickly and them having you know, cute little kids and everything. Babies, I, I, I know nothing about these people, right? But this mm -hmm. dude is really big and he's just, excuse the, this is an Australianism. He's built like a brick shit house, right? Mm -hmm. And she's tiny and petite and I was like, oh, my God, how's this going to work? Babies, something, and we, we talked about this, you know, polar opposites. Have you heard of something <laughs> like that? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yeah, I know something about that. <laughs> so it's like, it feels like, yeah, how does it work? It's like almost like those opposites help it work. I didn't know this, but in her last relationship, she was in a relationship I know too much um, with this guy from Britain for six years. And he was, he from what I know, I don't know anything about him. He looked like an absolute dick. So every time they went to an award show or whatever, he would be pissed that he had to be there with her and he didn't want anyone to know about the relationship. And every time the prop paparazzi came around, he'd pull her into the pull her into the um, car to speed away and stuff for six years. And here she's such a vibrant life force that now when her and Kelsey, I mean, Travis, come together in public it's almost like part of it that her being prevented from doing that for six years almost makes it like it's healing for her to be um seen with him and him not caring he he doesn't care he can take the limelight he, it's not gonna knock him off they both have so here's the thing though um so you jen you were saying that you know she might be aware enough and dynamic enough to be able to weather all this stuff. i actually don't i i don't care how you know put together you are when you are constantly under a barrage of attack, after a while it does wear you down. The only thing that yeah. amazes me is why Trump hasn't crumbled into a pile of shit yet. Because Wait a minute, though. We haven't seen him in like a week. Like last week he was on everything, like um, screwing up on all these things. And now there's. I think they pulled him. Either they pulled him or... He's incapacitated. I really think he's incapacitated right now. Mm. But yeah. And oh, by the way, I know what it's like to have those assaults constantly. And I think you and I have the strength to um, 
to transcend them. Let's just say that. So it's it's not about it's not always about just weathering them, because that can get really, you know, just making yourself hard and um and just taking the hits. That's not what it's about. It's about keeping your vantage point high enough so the hits don't even hit you. It's like, oh, what's happening down there? Who cares? And that's what we do. That session was a, a great reminder that it is tough, you know, when you're, you know, all of the people in this group, um, you know, so when you're operating at a higher vantage point, um, you know, it is actually quite an inter interesting phenomenon when you do then get buffeted by, you know, uh, this world issues, then, um, you know, to maintain that vantage point is it's actually quite a skill. At one level, I'm just wondering that, you know, when you sort of elevate at a higher vantage point and you get knocked down, I wonder if that is actually more difficult to 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 deal with than if someone's just always sort of just basically existing at a low level of vantage point and they're just constantly getting, you know, whatever. It's just I'm just wondering if that knockdown is actually more challenging to navigate through. It Yes, and it's just another muscle. It's like you learn to get up. All you have to do is get up one more time more than your head. So you keep getting hit, you keep raising the vantage point, and you keep doing it to such a point that it doesn't even feel like you're doing anything. If you like this content and you appreciate the work that we're doing to uplift all of humanity and to help heal your body, mind, and soul, please consider becoming a Genuine Healing Premium Content subscriber. Simply jump onto the Genuine Healing website, genuinehealing.com with a J, and scroll to the Purchase button on the top menu. Scroll down, there's a Premium Content uh, option. Click on that, sign up. It's a simple monthly plan for $20 a month, and you will have access to all of the premium content that we put up on the Genuine Healing website. We put up hundreds of videos up there and every week or so we're putting up new premium content. This really is your resource hub. Thanks for watching the video and look forward to seeing you next time. Bye for now.